Creating a sign or label in Microsoft Word can be achieved by following these simple steps or using one of the many templates that are available with each Durlabel printer CD. There is also Microsoft Help for additional assistance. Depending on your operating system, items may be referring to something slightly different than what we have described here. In this example, we will be making a 4-inch by 6-inch label using Durlabel 4-inch white vinyl supply. The sign will contain a header, basic text on the left, and a symbol on the right. Let's open Microsoft Word by clicking on the Start button on your desktop, highlighting the Program tab, and selecting the Microsoft Word application. The first step in creating a label or sign in Microsoft Word is to set up the document to match the desired label dimensions. To do this, click on the Page Layout tab at the top of the window and then click the Page Setup box. Under the Margins tab, set all margins to zero. Set your orientation to the desired layout. For this example, we'll use Landscape. Next, click on the Paper tab. This is where the label size will be set. Since we are printing in landscape orientation, the height will equal the width of the tape we're printing on. In this case, since we are using 4-inch white vinyl, we'll set the height to 4 inches and the width of the label to 6 inches, and then click OK. If a warning dialog box appears, click Ignore. Next, we will create the header for our label. Click on the Insert tab at the top of the window, and then click the text box icon. From the drop-down menu, click on the Simple text box icon. Enter the header text you'd like to have on the label. To change the font, select the text, and then click on the Home tab at the top of Word. The font section is where you can change the type of font, font size, and font style. To resize the text box, click on any one of the eight markers on the perimeter line of the text box and drag it to resize the text box. To center the text, highlight the text, click on the Home tab, and then click on the Center Text button at the top of the screen. Let's reverse print a text box. In other words, invert the colors so that the text will appear the same color as your chosen vinyl and the black area of the header will be the color of your chosen ribbon. Simply left-click inside the text box and click on the Format tab at the top of Word. Then click on the Format Shape box. From there, click on the Fill tab and select Solid Fill. Change the fill color to black and click Close. Move the text box by hovering over the perimeter line until you get the Move Cursor icon and drag it to the desired position on the label document. Next, we will add and position the message text on the sign. Click on the Insert tab at the top of the window and then click on the text box icon. From the drop-down menu, choose the simple text box icon. Type the text that you want on your label. To change the font, select the text and click on the Home tab at the top of Word. The font section is where you can change the type of font, font size, and font style. To resize the text box, click on any one of the eight markers on the perimeter line of the text box and drag it to size. To align the text, highlight the text, click on the Home tab, and then click on the Center Text button at the top of the screen. To remove the text box borderline, left-click on the text box. Click on the Format tab at the top of Word, and then click on the Format Shape box. From here, click on the Line color, and then select No Line, and then close the dialog box. Move the text box by hovering over the perimeter line until you get the Move Cursor icon, and then drag it to the position on the label document. To 
add an image, click on the Insert tab and then click on Picture. Search for the picture on your computer and click Open. In order to move the image around on the label document, you will need to apply text wrapping that is set to anything except in line with text. To do this, click on the image and then on the Format tab at the top of the screen. Click on Wrap Text and then select, for example, Tight. This will allow you to freely move the image into the desired position. To resize the image, click on the image and then click on any one of the eight markers on the perimeter line and drag it to size. Clicking on the corner circles of the image will keep the height and width ratio even. Move the image by hovering over the perimeter line until you get the Move Cursor icon and then drag it to the correct position on the label document. Once you are done adjusting your signed document, click on File, Save As, and Save to the desired location. To print, go to the File Print, set your print properties, click Print, and your new label will be printed and ready to be applied immediately. Now that you know how to insert and format text boxes and images in Microsoft Word, you will be able to open one of the many templates that come with DuraLabel printers and customize them to fit your needs or create a custom label from scratch. For more information about DuraLabel printers, visit our website at www.duralabel.com or give us a call at 1-888-326-9244.